I just love walking, so. I feel about a forest gun <laughs> When I have spare time, all I do is walk because I love walking, so good for the soul. So people ask me what are the best things about the walk, but there are so many good things. Really, the landscape is stunning. And that's what I've really enjoyed. The low lights are probably easier to tell you about. On um, crossing the Severn Bridge was a real trial for me. And I actually thought that if I get to John O'Groats, crossing the Severn Bridge will be an even bigger achievement because I suffer really badly with vertigo. So the way I approached it was um, I woke up very early one morning, just before sunrise, looked out the window and the sunrise was going to be stunning. Woke my sister-in-law and said, we're doing it today and we just did it, went. I've managed to find some accommodation through my local church or through the Teen Tear Fund. And even a friend who lived in the village 30 years ago has made contact, which is wonderful. And she's found me free accommodation with a minister on, on the route. On the, but uh, we don't look too far ahead because my husband said before I started walking, it's one, something he says all the time, all will be well, all will be well. So I don't worry about accommodation because I think God will provide for me, so. I haven't really got to the stage where I thought I can't reach another step. I've, I'm doing 14 milers as an average, but we have done up to 18. And at 18, I'm thinking, I'm not really awfully enjoying this. <laughs> However, no, I've never thought I'm going to give up, really. So. so you do have a lot of time to think about things and about yourself as a person and how to reflect on things you've done in your life and how you would do things differently maybe in the future and about relationships yeah you do you do have a it's a really precious time actually hmm. I mean I spend a lot of time in prayer when I'm walking just simple prayers and I pray that the Lord will be in front of me paving my way and be beside me encouraging me on and that's what I would hope that Tear Fund supporters would pray for as well. Absolutely mad. My husband thinks I'm crazy. But he's a very kind man. And she just lets me do these crazy things. No, they just think I'm bonkers.